A live look outside our city tonight on the eve of the kickoff to Memorial Day weekend. We're looking ahead tonight to everything you'll want to know from public safety to travel and the first alert forecast. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman is live for us downtown, breaking down the approach to keep things peaceful this weekend. Marissa. Well, Joe and Erica, this will be the mayor's first major holiday as the city's top leader. We do know policing will be up, but that's on top of the mayor's focus, his strategy on community and collaboration. In the middle, this big, huge one, we're going to do a pumpkin patch. It doesn't look so like much, but this empty pumpkin. space in Englewood will soon become a garden. And that's what it's about. This is this is for the community. It will be built, too, by young people who live here, like Del Rico and Del Brianna Cox. I decided by like seeing it come beautiful. I'm excited to like help the plants grow. Most of the kids that I know, they like picking up bad habits. And I hate to see them pick up bad habits because it's not really cool. And we packed them up in boxes. And Kenneth Griffin is a Chicago police officer who also runs No Matter What, a nonprofit based in Englewood. He's just one of five grassroots organizations that will get a piece of the city's $2.5 million investment to curb crime this summer. Griffin knows Memorial Day weekend traditionally marks the start of a spike in street violence. But we're not having that over here in Inglewood. He supports the mayor's holistic approach to safety. But this is the opportunity uh, for, for the mayor to throw resources directly into the community and to help these young people understand that you do not have to commit crimes. You do not have to be a part of the violence that um, exists. That focus made clear. This is not just simply a strategy around policing. You have a collaboration of individuals who are committed to making sure that there's activity in Chicago. But Griffin hopes this weekend kicks off a fresh chapter for Chicago, and it starts in his neighborhood. We want to show these kids that no matter what you go through, no matter what your circumstance is, you can make it out and you can literally be a blessing to your community. Now, as part of the mayor's strategy, officers will have one day off canceled to cover the city over the holiday weekend. That's on top of the state sending down 30 peacekeepers to cover the city and the lakefront. Reporting live in Streeterville, I'm Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Joe, Erica. All right, Marissa, thank you.